guys and welcome to today's video. So today I am going to be sorting through my wardrobe. I'm going to be selling a bunch of stuff on Depop as well but I thought this would just be like a massive organisation video. I was selling a bunch of my clothes on Depop a little while ago and then I ended up buying some more. You can see where the issue is here. I don't have loads of clothes but I do have quite a few that I don't wear and they're just sat in my wardrobe completely unloved and it'd be great if I could give them to a new home. So I'm gonna be sorting through my wardrobe because I'm going back to university as well. I'm not moving into student accommodation. I'm actually moving into a house. So I am taking all of my stuff with me. I won't be coming back in the summer. So it's like I will permanently be living in Cornwall. I mean, I can take everything, but I don't want to. So just to give me some extra bits of cash because I do have to furnish my room as well. So to get me some extra savings and all that type of stuff, I'm gonna be selling a bunch of my clothes. But come the time when I move in, in September, I will probably just take the rest of it that it doesn't sell to a charity shop. If you see anything you like in this video, please go and check my Depop out. I will price everything up in this video because I'm gonna show you guys some of the things as well. So yeah, this is like the purpose of this video, me showing you guys what I'm gonna be selling as well as like a process of it all and me just doing a massive deep cleanse of my wardrobe. This is my wardrobe. Um, A lot of this stuff is stuff that I do actually wear but i'm gonna sort through this and find bits and bobs that i don't wear as well as all this i've got all my shoes down here and then i've also got stuff in my drawers these boxes here are full of stuff that is like bits that i've already sorted and i don't wear also stuff that's already on my depot So these are all the items of clothing that I want to keep. I'm going to sort all of this out as well, like maybe into colours or something, maybe into like, I want to organise whatever's going on here. I'm actually going to be selling a lot of my jeans. Again, I've come to that point in my life where like, don't hate me, but I wear flares a lot. And I just bought a pair of wide leg jeans. Honestly, they're the best thing ever. They're like the best thing I've ever invested in. Skinny jeans, I don't find comfortable anymore. I don't find them as flattering anymore. Also just like the struggle of getting in a pair of jeans is just like too much for me. I've got a pair of Levi's here that I haven't even worn. As you can see, they're like 60 pounds. Um, and I, these have been on my Depop for a really long time and they are not selling. I'm selling them for 20 pounds at the moment. So if you want a right bargain, there you go i've also got another pair exactly the same pair and i don't really wear them so i'm probably going to sell both of these so yeah if you do want like some bargains there is like going to be a fair amount of stuff that i'm going to be selling that's not like just stuff that i don't want like stuff that is actually like decent so i'm just going to sort my actual wardrobe out into like i want to say colors i don't think i'm going to do it in colors i'm probably going to do it in like my jumpers my tops my like skirts like that um so i'm just gonna do that now and then i will get on to going through all of this okay so i've got all of my jumpers here i've got tops here trousers here skirts here and then dresses at the end I'm starting to realise how mishmashy my wardrobe actually is, but we move past that. There is a bunch of my clothes in the wash because I've not long come back from Brighton, so a bunch of that is getting washed because obviously I wore it when I was away. I thought I'd also just chat a little bit about my measurements as well. So all my measurements are here. Um, I am 5'7". I'm pretty, I feel like I'm an average height, but some people say I'm tall. To others, I'm probably not. Um, but yeah, my feet are size four and a half to a five. My sizes vary so much depending on the shops, but usually on my top half, I'm between like an eight or a 10. On my bottom half, it varies between 10, 12. I do have a pair size 14 jeans from H&M. So it does really vary, but yeah, I hope that helps. <laughs> I'm taking all these prints off the wall. Uh, if anyone's interested, these are prints from my business I've just set up. If you want to go and check that out, please feel free to do so. I do actually have a giveaway going on at the moment. So if you are interested in maybe getting some free pieces of art or some like personalised stuff as well, please go, um, go check that out. 
So it's gonna be hard to like film me taking photos of stuff because, because I left my charge for my camera in Brighton, my auntie is actually sending it to me in the post. But uh, obviously I can't film me taking photos of stuff. So all I'm gonna say is like, I've made a white background. When you're posting stuff on Depop, people wanna actually see it on you and see how it fits, um, see how see-through it is if it is see-through. If you are selling things on Depop, don't just like take a photo on a coat hanger because people do actually want to see what it looks like on. Also, good lighting is key because you want to be able to see the product and a good quality photo goes a long way. So yeah, so I'm going to put my phone on my tripod and I'm going to take photos and videos of all of these clothes. Um, I might not put everything in this video, but I'm going to like montage it all together so you guys can see. So this is my organized mess. This is stuff that I've not sold from my last video that's currently still on my Depop. So I'll insert lots of clips of everything that's here so I don't need to refilm it. start off with all the tops and take photos of them. I also thought I'd just let you know that I write everything down that I'm going to be selling. So this is all the stuff that I've currently got listed on my Depop shop. I'm going to be writing every single thing down and listing how much I'm selling it for. So yeah, this is going to take a really long time. I might end up actually doing some of this stuff tomorrow because it's probably going to take that long. <laughs> Hi guys, so it is like day three of trying to sort everything out. Yesterday I spent the whole time making drafts up for Depop for selling my items. Turns out Depop only lets you go up to 50 drafts. So, so I've still got a lot of stuff to upload onto Depop. The stuff you've just seen is only a small percent. This is the rest of the stuff that I was photographing at the weekend. Again, if you like any of the items, just go check out my Depop. Also, I'm gonna sort through my drawers because I didn't actually get a chance and they're like so messy. So I'm gonna just do, I'm gonna just do a bit of organization as well today and yeah. added so many items to my depot it's ridiculous so hopefully it gets budged and like i said at the start of the video if it doesn't go by mid-september it will all be going to a charity shop before i go to university so yeah thank you so much for watching this video really hope you enjoyed it i'll leave all my social medias linked in the description down below including my depot uh so thank you again for watching this video and have a